Hey everybody, BTFMC 1984 here again, and today I'll be taking a look at the brand new Kroger Stores 2014 Halloween set. Now there is a set of five cars. They are now hitting your local Kroger or Kroger brand um, retailers. Uh, they started popping up on the East Coast about a week or two ago, and now West Coast is slowly starting to get them, but it is only the 25th of September right now. So be patient, they'll be coming. Now there are five cars, and let me just show you them, and I'll talk about each one. First up is number one of five, the 75 or 57 Plymouth Fury. This is known as Christine to a lot of you uh, Plymouth collectors, Halloween collectors, horror story collectors. Um, really nice, a nice forest or a army drab olive green. Uh, nice metallic finish. It's got this nice uh, black with yellow accented flames. Nice black roof. The hood's also got the exact same kind of flame job. Got the PR5 wheels, purple windows, a black interior, a plastic gray base, metal body of course. You got the Plymouth logo on the trunk lid and you got the Halloween logo right here which is the pumpkin and Hot Wheels logo. Really like it. Uh, love the card art they've gone for this year. You got the rig of mortar. You've got some pumpkins. You got it busting through a gate. Got a zombie crossing. Beautiful moon. Got bats. Got a werewolf or a wolf. A haunted house up top on the hill. You got uh, maybe it's a treasure hunt. No, just kidding. Got the Hot Wheels logo there. Big, nice, basic Hot Wheels. Really nice. You got one of five. A nice little ball motif to go around the name. Really, really nice. I'm glad that they've, uh, they're have still going to be using this as kind of the go-to for Halloween. All right, next up, number two of five is the Gangster Grin. The Ford Gangster Grin. And they really did a good job on this. You got some nice, subtle, like tribal type um, flames on it not too so, not you know not too bright of or not as strong of flames as the fury has but real nice kind of got a ghost right there that just kind of swoops in clear wheels tin, clear tin spokes chrome plastic base it is a metal body uh, looks like there is, it is a gray a light gray interior and nice smoky tinted windows really really dig it it does look a lot like a ghost before to even put the stripings and paint on it really nice i think hot wheels did an excellent job at that now number three of five which has been what people have been begging for for years with the holiday cars We've never gotten it. I never really got an official one. We've had it float in the multi packs at Target. The Bone Shaker. Finally, a dedicated Halloween Bone Shaker. We've been, as collectors, been wanting a Bone Shaker in a Halloween set. Never gotten it. And now we finally do in 2014. Really beautiful purple. It looks blue on my camera, at least from how I'm looking at it. I don't know how it's going to look like on YouTube. But nice purple. Got the hull or graveyard garage. Sorry, I got cat hair all over this thing. Nice white with uh, orange chrome accented on the rims. White interior. Metal base, metal body, which is really nice. It is the opened uh, cabin version. Looks like I got a little bit of an error on mine. It's kind of melted in the middle of the dash. Now, unfortunately, this is not a glow in the dark car. Uh, I think it's where really Hot Wheels dropped the ball, at least on the uh, Bone Shaker or all of these cars. No glow in the dark paint, no glow in the dark plastics. Uh, holiday cars, especially this, would have been perfect. You got mainline with the glow in the dark stuff, but no Halloween? Come on, Hot Wheels. This would have been perfect for a glow in the dark uh, deck or parts. But I guess uh, some of the collectors that buy these. And customizers are going to be happy because there's no more stripping of chrome or dark colors. The light colors of the interior are, make it a lot more easier to paint. So can't wait to see people customize this guy. 
Next up is number four or five, the Rigor Mortar. Rigor Mortar, there we go. Uh, really nice. I'm glad they finally actually used the card that's on the card in the uh, packaging. Usually it's a, like I said, generic bone shaker, but we've never gotten it. And now we have what's on the card in package. Even though it's slightly different, it's a nice dark red. This is, of course, black with uh, white and green tampa wing. Really nice. It's got the uh, green um, dome or green glass. Gold chrome uh, for the engine, the oil and the or fuel, and the bat that's on the front. Green for the uh, radiator and skulls. Got green wheels with black accents in the spokes. Metal base, of course. Metal body. Really, really dig this. Um, it's getting not glow in the dark. You know, you just use bright greens. Would be nice to see this uh, glow in the dark, but. What can you do? And last but not least is number five of five, Ecto One, making its return to the holiday Halloween cars. This was available a couple years ago. Almost kind of like the same decoing, but a little bit different. It's a nice orange with some uh, white or yellowish white, some slight yellow, green, black. Tampo's got a nice um, pumpkin hidden in the flames on the hood. Um, metal body, plastic base, gold chrome, five spokes, dark green or gray uh, roof accessory, a roof mount equipment, green windows, uh, gray interior. Really, really love this. And this one is going to be the tricky one to find for a lot of you collectors because. People are going to pick this up. And what I really like about this, I don't know if the original one had it, but we got the Ghostbusters No Ghost on the uh, tailgate. This was even missing on the first edition model. So I'm really, really glad they put the No Ghost on a basic model. Uh, these, let me get the receipt real here. Sorry for my lack of uh, professionalism. Now these are going to retail for $1.99 at your stores, but if you have on their um, VIP cards, like in, at Fry's, you get $0.50 cents off, so about $1.50 per car. Really, really nice. So not too bad for basically $2 cars. You get a decent card art. Cards are spectacular. They fit the theme of the holiday. And we finally got the Bone Shaker and... Uh, the uh, assortment for Halloween, so that's really, really nice. So that is it for my look at the 2014 holiday Halloween Kroger Fries, Fred Meyer, Smith's, yada, yada, yada. Don't know all the names of the cars. That is it for now. I hope you enjoy. And if you did, thanks for watching. I'll talk to you guys all later. And just a side note real quick before I end this. When you guys are shopping and you happen to stumble across these and you find if it's a fresh bin or whatever and you see a few of the Bone Shaker and Ecto ones, please be generous and leave at least one or two behind. I've done this, I'm starting to do this now with treasure hunts, supers, and regulars just to leave one behind. That way the next collector behind me can find it in person to get that thrill again and not have to go, oh, I've gotten... You know, I can only get, you know, three of them, but I miss, I'm going to be missing two. At least leave a couple behind so someone else can get their collection as well. So that is it for me for now. So I hope you all enjoy. Take care, everybody. Bye-bye. Be safe out there and have fun collecting. Bye-bye.